California lawmakers rejected a request today to audit the way state funds are used by Planned Parenthood. That audit request came on the heels of controversy over secretly recorded videos. The people who released those videos claim that they show Planned Parenthood executives talking about the sale of fetal tissue. KCRA 3's Kevin Oliver is here now with more on how that controversy ended up at the state capitol. Well, Edie, the proposed audit would have looked at how much money, how much Medi-Cal money is used to fund abortions and whether any fetal tissue was used or donated from those abortions. I am not here to ask you to defund Planned Parenthood, okay? Assembly member Melissa Melendez told the audit committee she recognized Planned Parenthood provides all sorts of health services, but she said it was time for an audit. I am not here to perform some sort of political witch hunt, as some have suggested. That is not what I'm here to do. I'm here to ask you to investigate how the funds that flow from the state's coffers to Planned Parenthood are spent. Sitting by her side, Holly O'Donnell, who worked for four months with STEM Express, a company that supplies biomedical researchers with blood and tissue samples. She described her first day on the job as a procurement technician. I asked her why I didn't, what, what is this? And she said, um, it's, it's, a good, it's a good thing, it's for medical research. O'Donnell worked with a group of activists who made a series of video making the rounds now on the internet targeting Planned Parenthood. It is selling fetal parts. Um, biomedical companies would not be hiring procurement technicians if they were not getting money from Planned Parenthood. Planned Parenthood executives told the committee the organization has complied with all state and federal laws and said there was no reason for an audit and also refuted the claims made in the video campaign. We believe that everything that's happening at the federal level is designed to serve a political agenda to defund Planned Parenthood. Then dozens of people, one after the other, filed before the committee to be heard. Most of them supported the audit, but in the end, only two members voted for it, both of them Republicans, and not enough to move forward with the audit. So an audit won't be coming from the legislative committee, but that doesn't mean that Planned Parenthood funds aren't audited. A representative from the state's Department of Health Care Services said they routinely conduct a number of their own audits, including millions of dollars that go to Planned Parenthood through Medi-Cal reimbursements.